The world of Roblox YouTube is filled with some interesting fellas, and I was thinking that today we can go figure out some of the interesting little games that interesting little developers have made that are attached to their names. I'm gonna be using like the obscure game finder, and I'm gonna be like putting in um these guys' names just to see what comes up. Let's do Flamingo first. I'm expecting these to be the best haunted house. Um that looks fun. I bet this is Flamingo's house IRL. Let's go. I bet his house looks exactly like this. It's got skeletons and everything. So you probably can't hear the volume, but there's some silly little ghost noises in the background. And thunder. Look, he's poking me. And that's the true story of how I died at Flamingo's household. The Colt family. I think they're a myth. They look kind of silly. You know what? Uh... I kind of don't want to mess around with them. I don't know what kind of tools they'd be having in there. We're just gonna get out of there. Ugly chocolate. Um, that'll do. Oh, look, I'm so pretty. I'm hungry, I say. This is a fun little house we have. Oh, we got a van. That's a good sign. I'm sure we won't do anything sketchy with it. Got a flashlight. Probably means I'm gonna be exploring some dark holes soon. It looks like I'm supposed to go in here, but I can't get in here. Grab the crowbar. Um, okay. Lucas. Guys, my name is Lucas. Oh yeah, that's what we needed. We couldn't get in because we weren't prepared to do sketchy things. Enter? Bro, this game's being a butthole. Let me enter. Let your pal Lucas in. Maybe there's a way around the back. Uh, it appears that that's exactly what there is. We're in a candy wrapper room with intense music. Here's some food. Let's go upstairs. Maybe I found like one out of four food. Hey there, little fella. It won't let me jump on his face. I hope you don't mind if I just like... Oh yeah, food. Dude, it won't let me get the diarrhea bread. Oh, this is the new place. Oh heck no, I don't like that. I'm full, I decided. I'm leaving. That's what my gaming setup IRL looks like. Um, let's do Flamingo one more time. Probably go steal some more people's chocolate. Da soup. I think I'm about to burp, so just be forewarned. Okay guys, actually I wasn't about to burp. Confirmed. We got a nice little, um, store with skateboards. And one? Yeah, well, let me click. It's got me stuck. The trickery. It brought me into this pen and stuck me here. Just like when Flamingo stuffs me in his basement. I think it's time for a new dude. Let's do Critcraft. Also, according to Google, here's his password. Buy the game pass. The way to the arrows are pointing are where I do Robux events. Oh yeah, the dev is just spitting facts. Real oob. YouTube Snow 798. I'm your char. Guys, these are all my new best friends. Like and subscribe so they can be your best friends too. Uh, I'ma follow the arrows so I can get the wear of the robux I want. Yes, no. Subscribe, like, and get free robux. Don't. That's not true. I'm just uh, vomit. I'm just vomiting words, okay? There are no free robux. Sorry for misleading you. I've made a continuous lapse in my judgment that I hope can be resolved. But I need your patience to make that possible. So give me all your patience, just like this guy is forcing you to buy his game pass, which behind me is clearly non-existent. I'm sorry you had to listen to that. I'm leaving now. Bye. Well, let's find him a new game. Boss Baby's Horror Mansion. Guys, this is all art by Creek Crafts fans. It's actually Creekcraft in five years. Oh, well, that's a fun little picture. It looks like me. Jake from State Farm. Let's see what Jake from State Farm plays. Apparently nothing. Too busy dry pressing his khakis. Back to Creekcraft. Get all kinds of just funny little games. Escape the foot. Oh crap, it's a maze. Um. Ha ha ha. Okay. Ha ha ha. That's funny. I got off on the wrong foot with the foot. Oh, I see him. Hey friend. Why are you pushing me? Guys, the foot is a bully. I kind of low-key do want to escape the foot now. Oh no, he's chasing me. I'm being chased by a giant foot. That's nice. Oh, there's more feet. It's a three-legged man. I do genuinely think that this is the best game we've been on today. Well, no, actually, the chocolate bar game was really well made. I'll give that one a lot of credit, despite the fact that I didn't finish it. Let's count the feet. One, two, three, eight, nine, ten. There's like ten feet in this maze. Whoever made this has 10 feet. His feet are actually kind of built like this. Let me show you. So this is the base foot. 
and there's two base feet because people have two feet. And off each base foot, there's five toes. Oh, it looks like a moose antler. But except the toes are actually feet too. So each toe looks a little something like this because each toe is actually a foot. And I think we should finish up by giving him some legs and a body. And we're gonna do some arms. His arms are normal. I'm gonna just scoot over here and give him another normal arm because this is what arms look like. He only has five fingers per arm, unlike his 25 toes. Also, I added a head, and we're gonna add a happy face because he's a happy man. Oh, my stomach hurts. I might puke later. Just a little bit of TMI. So now that we found a satisfactory game for Creek Griff, it's time to see what Dennis gets up to in his spare time. Okay, uh, Dennis Daly. Guy protects his house from 12 robbers, and I'm only assuming that that robber is Dennis Daly. There are actually 12 of him, and he comes and robs your house at night. Oh, it's gonna make me wait for players. Um, I'm gonna have to leave this one, but we do have the valuable knowledge now that Dennis is a robber. That's why he's in jail. Albert's struggle. Oh, it looks like there relationships getting a little a little rough dennis is starting to have some ill will towards his pal albert there something is bothering you yeah it's my stomach that hurts you feel like you forgot to do something yeah i forgot that you shouldn't eat pure onions first thing in the morning that's right you forgot to pay your taxes yeah i don't pay those oh i am albert guys me albert it's caden and creek craft Albert is cheating on Dennis with, with Caden and Creekcraft simultaneously. And Tempress too. Oh, and a toilet. I guess like Dennis is just gonna emerge from the toilet later. Grab stupid key. Yeah, okay, I'll grab that. I remember what this ladder's for. You go wee! Hello? Albert? Albert, who are you? I'm your long lost friend. Um, okay. Hello, I just checked and your channel is dying. And I know you're in debt. Debt? I think his net worth is like 20 million dollars. I don't think he's in debt. I know a way to fix it, but it's not gonna be easy. What am I supposed to do, man? You have to run away, Albert, or they will find you. Ooh, you don't have time, Albert. You have to run away. Where do I go then? I know someone who has made a time machine. We can undo the mistakes you made in the past. Where is he at? He's this dude you probably find at a skate park. Oh, uh, okay. It looks like you're stuck inside of this room. A key should be in the bathroom or in the closet. Come back to me when you find it. Actually, the key doesn't do anything, lol. I just wasted your time. The door is unlocked already. So I'm guessing they is Dennis, and Dennis is just like coming for revenge because because of Albert's affair with Creekcraft, Tempest, and Caden. F, go to the skate park. That's a really good tactic for running away from your debt in real life. If you go to the skate park, you can never go to debtor's prison. The reason Charles Dickens lost his family is because they simply did not go to a skate park like they should have. Um, hello? It's Felipe. Who are you? You should know who Albert is. He's your father. My name is Albert. What's your name? You should know who this guy is. He's your son. My name is Poke. Okay, Poke, someone said that you have a time machine, so can I pretty please go back in time to undo my mistakes? What mistakes? Cheating on Dennis? No, shut up. Yeah, that's what I say to anyone who wants a second chance. That's the best way to deal with a problem. Huh? I meant to say yes, but you gotta find some batteries to power this sucker up. Sure, Pokemane. I thought you just asked his name, and then you got his name, and then all of a sudden, you know his full name. That's a little sus, Albert. Alright, batteries. I'm guessing that these are the Duracell batteries. Apparently, those are not the Duracell batteries. Oh, there's the battery. Guys, what if Poke is just using us to escape his own fate? Okay, here's another battery. It won't let me get it. Okay, and here's the third one. And now we can use the time machine. Proof that Duracell is the best battery brand guys. Hey, we can talk to Poke again. Was this your room when you were a kid? Yeah, I think. So he did hit his head on a rock. He can't remember. It's a nice room in the 2000s, but I think we need to do something quick before young Albert comes back to this room. Although we time travel, you can't come across yourself in the past. But why are we here? I think one of your big mistakes was here. Um, what am I supposed to do here? Well, I see something on a wall that looks like a cartoon picture of you. I'm not sure. Oh, I see. Albert stuff. Go. Cool. Try to solve the puzzle. Okay, I'll try to. Uh, I think I accidentally broke the puzzle. Oh, get wife. We have to protect her. It's a fair point. You were kicked from this experience. You got the good ending. Well, that's that. The debt is fixed. We had a pretty good run today. We got a snack, got smothered by Creekcraft's feet, and Flamingo is no longer in debt. Yeah, bye.